Hello, hello, my spiritual beings, and welcome into Speak Life. My name is Mia. Today, this reading is going to be dedicated to those of you who are waiting for someone, waiting for an apology, waiting to be validated, waiting to be recognized. Um, what started this was once upon a time, I was watching a self-help video, and I came across a saying that said, I feel like I could have been in a better place if I didn't have to wait for you. I will be posting that either at the beginning or the end of this video or both. And um, that is very powerful. For me, when I heard that, I literally cried my eyeballs out because I realized that there was a large, a large portion of my time and in my life where I was waiting for somebody to make those decisions for me. And for me, that was very, very like that, that really hit a nerve for me. And, um, you know, I was able to release that pain that I was holding from, you know, from that, because let me tell you, like I said, it, it was something like I had to dissect it because it was like when I heard the part if I didn't have to wait for you, something in my heart collapsed, okay? So um, here we are, and we're going to be doing this reading for those of you who are waiting uh, for a lover, waiting for an apology. Listen, life waits for no one, okay? Um, please, universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors, please bring forward any messages from spirit Universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors. <clears throat> These universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors. Okay. So we have here the Queen of Swords. Some of you have made a decision. Okay, this is something uh, that comes from being scorned. The feelings are cold. Okay. They are not warm. This is a person who has been let down. This is a person who's, who's cried. This is a person who's learned to defend herself. Any decision that he or she has made or you have made um, is very strict. It's very, um, this is what I'm going to do and that's it. For some of you, this has got to do with somebody who is um, an emperor. Okay, this is somebody who is powerful. This person is also um, very controlling in my eyes. I also see here the princes of wands. Okay, so this is someone coming in, not knowing if they should go or stay. Okay, this is the I'm not sure what lands I'm standing on, but I really don't know what to do. For some of you... You are either finding some spiritual balance in your life, looking for some healing. This is also looking for some spiritual advice, okay? And I also want to let you know that for some of you, you may even potentially be married, okay? We are going to be, I don't know the name of this deck, but I will put it down below for those of you that are interested. This is the first time I'm using it. I've had it forever, I have many decks, <laughs> a collection. Why is the Queen of Swords here? Yeah, I don't know the name. Oh boy, listen, you get the Hierophant again. I'm gonna show you, hold up. Here it is, here is the Hierophant. And in the bottom, it says morals. For some of you, like I said, it's married, you know, being part of a moral relationship, having, for some of you, a spiritual awakening, becoming aware of a situation. You also have here the seven of wands. So that's bravery. Some of you are literally fighting on your own. Listen, this is an illusion. Okay. For some of you who are going through a difficult time waiting for someone, listen, this is an illusion. Okay. This is not real with the seven of cops. This is being lost and confused in a situation where you really don't see an outlet. 
Um, it is, you know, being disillusioned, you know, it's, it's like going into a fucking candy store and it's like looking at all the candy and all of a sudden the, the guy is like, you can't buy anything because we closed, but you're still open. Yeah, but we closed a minute ago. So you can't no longer buy anything. And you're like lost and confused. Like, really? What the hell? Like, all I want is some fucking candy. You know? Okay. Why is the emperor here? Why is the emperor here? Some of you are dealing with somebody who is not. I mean, this person may be important. But I'm going to tell you, I just get the feeling. Okay, listen, they're going to come back in. They're going to invent some bullshit ass in their minds, okay? And they're going to come back in with an apology, okay? They're going to be like, sweetheart, can we please talk? I need to say something. And this person is going to try to manipulate you right back into their life. But listen, the problem is that, you know, some of you are a queen, king. You know, somebody who's made a strict decision. Somebody who's not going to allow someone to manipulate them and that's what i'm picking up why is the princess of wands here why is the princess of wands here please universal energies spirit Ooh. okay hold up wow this is a lot we're gonna go through them five of pentacles poverty some of you do not know if you should go or stay because this particular person was taking care of you and you know that if you leave this situation you are going to be look i'm not even making this up it says poverty okay um this is being left out in the cold okay um this person chose to do something else left you out in the cold somebody here wants to apologize you also get the five of wands which is rival rivalry okay i don't even know if i'm spelling that i mean saying that right um the five of wands okay this is jealousy amongst two people okay could be more than two people this is you know this is more than three actually um this is third party situation as well oh my lord look at what you have here too you have the five of cups how is that even possible listen some of you are really 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 on the land of instability while you're waiting for this person okay you are so deep in your emotions this is having regret okay the only one that's missing here right now is the five of cups. And so we'll see if that comes out before we close up this reading. Okay, so you have here the three fives. For some of you, this is instability caused by a third party interference. Listen, this could be a job. It could be another male or another female. If it could even be family, okay? You have here the justice, equality. Okay, so for some of you, there, there is a situation for some of you, this could turn into a legal matter. Okay. For some of you, this could be trying to find the balance, trying to make things even after someone mistreated you, they did not give you the same thing that you gave them. Page of swords. Somebody came in, somebody came in and spoke some truth. Somebody was very honest about the situation. Okay. This is you looking and making an inspection and really looking really close. For some of you, listen, this could be spying as well. Um, someone looking through the binoculars, looking at you very, very closely. Queen of Wands, okay, determination. Some of you are ready to step forward in this situation. With the Queen of Wands, I am picturing that some of you are really taking care of yourself and determined to move forward in some cases the third party here was another woman another man okay um let's see let's see if there's anything else i want to clarify of course there is why is the hierophant here twice why is the hierophant here twice please universal energies why is the hierophant here twice the hermit some of you are healing from a situation the hermit here it is 
Okay, this is introspection. This is looking within. This is going into solitude. It is also um, withdrawing from a situation so that you can think, so that you can heal, so that you can figure out all the answers to all those questions. You also have here the wheel, which is changes. I'm going to tell you, whoever I am reading for, okay, you have some major arcanas here, okay, with the emperor the Hierophant twice, and you also have um, the Hermit and the Wheel. So there are some changes that are going to come in. However, I just want to let you know that some of you are really going to have to heal in order for you to step through the portal into this next chapter, you know, because there's something that's coming in to change super quick for you with the Wheel of Fortune. Okay, and most of this, even though there's a shift in change, a lot of you are dealing with a lot of instability. So you have here four major arcanas, but still five major arcanas, but still dealing with a lot of instability, still not dealing, still not being in the right place, still not being comfortable enough to let go. Okay, um, <clears throat> why is the five of cups here? Why is the five of cups here? <clears throat> Three of wands. Three of wands waiting for your ships to come in. Five. Oh, wait. Oh, my Lord. You're not even going to believe this. Five of swords. That was the one that was missing. I said it was the cups, but it was actually the swords that was missing. Now, listen. Listen up to those of you that are waiting around. I need you to see this. You literally have all the four fives, okay, in this reading. Okay, and that spells a lot of instability due to a third party interference. So I'm going to tell you, while some of you are waiting around, and then you get the, the three of wands, which is waiting as well. That's why it says in the bottom, Patience, okay? It is waiting. It is having the fucking patience to deal with so much, even though you have been treated so unfairly. Listen, you have here your heart. For some of you, your heart is bleeding. This person just didn't give two Fs about you, okay? They literally left you out in the fucking cold to deal with everything by yourself, okay? By yourself. And you also have here the seven of wands. You better find some bravery, okay? You better find a way how to take care of you because I'm telling you, this person is not going to do it. You can sit around and wait and listen. You can feel defeated, okay? This is how you're going to feel. You're going to feel defeated. You're going to feel abandoned. You're going to feel like if you were part of broken promises. But listen, the time has come to close the cycle, okay? Because literally, you end the reading with the work, with the wheel, okay? So change is here. Embrace it gracefully, okay? Embrace it. Okay. Listen, there's a brand new spanking beginning coming in for you with the Ace of Cups, okay? The thing is that you need to balance out and heal completely from this major instability, okay? It's a lot of instability. Why is the Page of Swords here? We're going to see if we can find out something about this truth, okay? These are the last ones. Seven of Swords. You're dealing with somebody who is sneaky, somebody who's not being honest. This person may potentially be holding back some money, some information, anything that will even help you out, okay? Um, you also have here the Ace of Wands. One more beginning, okay? This is using your energy. And for some of you, I want you to see that there is a baby in this pumpkin, okay? So be very careful that some of you on a night of passion do not end up having a baby with somebody that you are just merely waiting for, okay? Um, you also have here the seven of pentacles. For some of you, I'm going to be honest with you, you have had the patience of seven years to look at this situation and in seven years nothing has really 
turns out, okay? So for some of you, you are going to see the progress and say, oh my God, it's been seven years. And then others of you are going to be like, holy shit, what am I doing? It's been seven years. You know what I mean? Pick where you want to be. Just keep in mind that the longer you wait for someone, your um, days are as well ticking away, okay? Waiting for someone is, is, is just, you know, sometimes it is self-sacrificing, okay? Thank you for, so much for being here. I hope that you were able to enjoy this and take care.